Hey, what's good YouTube? It's J Dot the Jammer. We back here again with these Windows 10 2 in 1 tablets. Surface Pro 3 on the left, right here. I can't remember what it's called. Lynx 12 V64 tablet on the right here. Um, let me break down the specs to you real quick. You got the Intel Core i3 here, which I think is a dual core at 1.8 gigahertz or something like that. Um, I'll, do you know what? I'll put the correct specs in the description below anyway but um 4 gig ram and 64 gigabyte ssd in the lynx 12 right here you've got an intel atom quad core processor right there i think that's at 1.44 gigahertz because i can see the box right here in front of me um it's got 4 gigabyte ram as well and it's got 64 gigabyte hdd apparently apparently it's got a hard disk drive in there but um judging by the thinness of it that's probably just a misprint on the box and I'm assuming it does also have an SSD in there. Both running Windows 10. Um, we're gonna just do a little benchmark on this application called, um, what is it called, Passmark? And basically what it does, like all benchmarks, it gives your system an overall score and it bases it on like five key elements of a computer. The CPU speed, the 2D you know, application performance, 3D application performance, memory, RAM speed kind of thing and it does your hard disk or SSD drive speed. So um, what we're gonna do is we're gonna just test the CPU first of all and see which one of these computers finishes the test a bit quicker. Um, run all CPU tests. I'm gonna try and do this at the same time and then we'll have a little race between them to see what is going down. All right, let me just get that set up. Three, two, oh, this is hard. Wait, hold on. I think I've done that right. Yeah, there we go. Three, two, one. There we go. So um, I'm going to let these tests run. Um, you know, I'm going to pause in and out and let you see which one's in the lead. It looks like it's quite tired at the moment. I mean, let's just watch it for a second. See what's going down. Yeah, they're, they're quite tired at the moment. So I'm going to pause it for a bit. Get back at the end. And it looks like the Surface Pro is in the lead a little bit there as you've just seen, but the, the Lynx is right behind it, like a second behind it. It's not even really an issue at all, but we're going to see what the two different scores are. Let's see which one finishes first. Oh, CPU single-threaded score taking a bit of a while. We got 2460 on the Surface Pro with the i3 processor there, and we have got, oof, we've got 1338 on the Lynx 12 right there. So let's have a little look at the scores individually. Can I get them both together so you can probably see that? There we go. So, oh, the scores, the scores are a bit strange. I mean, for example, in the Integra math score, you got 3569 on the links. On the Integra math score here, you got, oh, 3622. So you got a bit more on the Surface Pro there. 16 there. Oh, I think, yeah, everything in general is higher on the Surface Pro than it is on the Lynx, which is to be expected, to be honest, um, given the two price points. But um, that's why I am, you know, reviewing these and testing them against each other in the first place. Now, we're going to do a memory score. I'm not really expecting much of a difference in terms of speed with the memory, because they're both 4 gigabytes RAM, but I've been surprised before, and... You know, I've realised that there are all these different speeds of memory, which I never re really used to care about in the past. But um, I've seen a couple of you know videos on YouTube where this new 2,666 hertz memory RAM, RAM memory, whatever you want to call it, is giving people a lot more frames per second when they're playing games. So I thought, you know, I'm going to test the memory, see what's really going down. Um. I'm gonna just, you know, I'm gonna just pause this as well. We'll just wait to the end because they, they seem like they're tying at the moment anyway. Guys, we are well in the lead on the Surface Pro right here. I'm not even sure what's going on. We're still stuck on memory write speed here on the Lynx. The Surface Pro has finished all those tests and now it's just completed it. 11.42 on the Surface Pro. Um, I'm gonna pause and see what the score is on the Lynx as well. We're gonna give that a bit of time to finish. Um, see what's going on there and there we go Oof, 539 on the links um, and we've got 1142 on the surface pro 
So it looks like the Surface Pro definitely has faster memory on, well, faster memory, yeah. Faster memory on the Surface Pro, there you go. Um, slower memory on the Lynx, um, but that's all in the price point. It, funny enough, um, there's actually, as you, I'm not sure if you can see that there, but there's 2,000 um, available memory RAM. I don't know why I keep calling it memory RAM. <laughs> but you've got 2,000 available RAM on the Lynx. And you've only got 1854 available memory on the Surface Pro. But um, apart from that, everything seems to be a bit a lot quicker on the Surface Pro. For example, memory read speed here is 4,000. Memory read speed on the Surface Pro, 10,000. Memory write speed here, 2,000. Memory write speed on the Surface Pro, 6,000, nearly triple the speed. So I think we'll just finish off with doing a little, you know, disk um, test and see how good the 64 gigabyte SSDs are on both of these devices. So I'm gonna just try and run these at the same time again. I don't think it even matters because the Pro usually comes out first anyway, but you know, we're gonna just pause it and see how it goes. Right, we have just finished here on the Surface Pro. We got 2,296. Um, we're still, we're always still going on the Lynx tablet. Um, but we're gonna give it a bit of time. Oh, there we go. Oh, 322. Wow. Wow, I don't even know if there's a point of me checking the specs. I mean, we, <laughs> wow, that is quite a difference. Um, nearly a tenth of the speed of the disc in the Surface Pro. Maybe it's a hard drive in here. I don't know what kind of flash memory they got going on in the Lynx, but um, the Surface Pro looks like it's nearly ten times quicker. But yeah, guys, um, thanks for watching. Surface Pro i3 model versus the Lynx 12 V64 Intel Atom Quad Core. Um, there you go, little pass mark, benchmark performance for you there you go so you know you know there you go there you go there you go there you go <laughs> anyway thanks for watching leave a comment in the comment section below subscribe if you haven't already if you have i will catch you in the next one j jamal out